Many students know that batteries produce electricity by converting chemical energy into electrical energy, but they may not understand the mechanisms that allow this to occur. The voltaic cell demonstrates some of the chemical reactions that can be used to create electricity. Students can also personally observe some of the evidence that the reaction is taking place. Attach zinc and copper electrodes to the clamps on the cup, then fill the cup with an electrolyte such as acetic acid. Positive zinc ions move into the solution and the zinc electrode acquires a negative charge. The zinc electrode acts as the cathode or negative terminal in this cell. The positive zinc ions repel positively charged hydrogen ions toward the copper plate. The hydrogen ions acquire electrons from this plate and form hydrogen gas. Students can see the gas bubbles being formed on the copper. Because the copper electrode loses electrons to the hydrogen, it becomes positively charged. It acts as the anode, or positive terminal, in this cell. When the two plates of the cell are connected by a conducting material, an electric current will flow from the copper to the zinc. This cell is capable of producing a potential difference of just over one volt. The voltage can easily be measured with a multimeter. Other electrode materials and electrolytes can also be used, and students can determine the most efficient materials. They will have fun creating electricity with this kit.